to another vlog. Happy Tuesday. It is actually already after 12, so <laughs> it's a little bit of a late start to the day in terms of vlogging. I did get a couple clips of my morning though, and yeah, I've been getting into a bit of a morning routine here. So walking honey to begin, doing my devotional, having coffee and all of that stuff. But we just came in from a walk and I have a couple of deliveries that just arrived, which is exciting. And then we also just made lunch. I'm about to go eat some lunch, so I'm excited for that. But you guys can see I'm definitely in more of a winter appropriate <laughs> attire than I normally am in Florida. So if you guys are new here, I just moved to Raleigh, North Carolina literally a few days ago. Uh, and yeah, I moved here on Friday and it's now Tuesday. I took the I took one day of vlogging yesterday just to get into the work routine here and just get myself situated, but now we're back into it and I wanted to just bring you guys along on a week in my life. Um, today I'm just wearing this really oversized uh, crew neck quarter zip kind of thing from Maritzia. It's so comfortable. And then I'm just wearing these black leggings from Lululemon, which are really comfortable and cute. I wore them in my moving vlog. So that is the outfit for today. Um, ignore some of the things in the apartment. We've had a couple of issues since moving in. One of the frames actually fell down in the middle of the night and apparently hit me on the head and I don't remember it. So I'm like, that's not a good thing. Uh, so we have to fix that. And then another thing is we had this big mirror that was here, like a huge mirror and it fell down and completely shattered because Honey went up and pushed it. I don't know what made her want to do that, but she did it and she shattered it. So now we don't have a mirror. So I don't know what we're going to do for the space here because now we just have the electric panels. <laughs> so that's what's new. But other than that, I got a really fun delivery in from Liquid IV. I'm now like one of their, I think it's like one of their ambassadors or something, but I love Liquid IV. They have such good products. They sent me a couple of things to try out. Um, like the immune support, the energy multiplier, and I already love these hydration ones. They're so good. The passion fruit and the lemon lime are really, really good. So but I have a discount code, so I'll leave it linked here for you guys. It's also on my Instagram and it's just 25% off. So if you want to try liquid IV, you guys can do it for 25% off, but I don't get any commission or anything like that, but I just love their products. And then I also just got in a package from Merit Beauty. I actually only wear Merit Beauty products now because I just love their products. They're so clean and just like minimal and that is so my vibe. So they sent me a couple of new things, which I'm so excited one of their about, including these new signature lips that they just launched. So I'll be sharing um, probably later this week um, a little makeup routine with these things because they're so cute and just show you how I use their products. But I'm obsessed with them and I'm so happy to have some more products from Merit. And then for lunch today, <laughs> Jay just made me this huge bowl. I just told him when I saw it, I was like, are you serious? I can't eat all that. That's like two lunches for me, but I'm going to do my best. But I'll have like the recipe, I guess, linked below because this is one of our new favorite things. We actually had this for lunch the other day from a store um, or a shop and we just recreated it last night and now we have a couple of leftovers. So this is so, so good. And we top it with um, this Italian vinaigrette. So that's gonna be lunch today. So yeah, welcome to the vlog. Subscribe if you guys are new and let's get into this week in my life. Hello everyone. So I just got back from a workout, Justin still in the gym working out. I just had a shower and now I'm in this comfy set. I was wearing this earlier, so. Hi, honey, girl. You don't think the vlog has seen you yet. Oh. oh, she's loving her new home. I think she likes the cooler weather here. Isn't that right? Yeah. But, oh my gosh, I have hair all over my face. Like I was saying, I put this back on, which I was wearing earlier from Aritzia, and then put on the matching joggers, which like, <laughs> these are them. So I'm in a complete like comfy sweatsuit, which is just the mood. It's about to pour down with rain and I think be kind of like a stormy night tonight. So that's kind of perfect. But this Amazon order just came in of these drawer dividers. I'll have them linked below. They're on my Amazon shop, but we desperately needed these for some organization. So this is going to be like kind of the part of the vlog where we just do some organizing things, just little things. I want to use these drawer dividers in the kitchen. And then I think in Justin's section of like our pull out drawers of our dresser in our bedroom. And then I need to organize the closet. I'm out of breath because I just finished my workout. It was really good. I'm proud of myself. I worked out yesterday and today. So let's see if I can keep it going. We'll see. 
I didn't work out at all last week, obviously, because we were moving, so that makes sense. But I got these off Amazon, they're wooden, and what's really cool is they can be made any size, so I can use them in the apartment, in any drawer, use them in a house in the future. I thought they were a good deal. <laughs> Organize the cupboard as well, so all of our clothes are in the cupboard, semi-organized, but I need to color code them. I'm not talking to you, <laughs> I'm talking to the camera, but I need to color coordinate our clothes. I'm gonna do this and then do that, so that's what we're up to. Okay, so I just finished up with the closet. This literally took me 10 minutes. This is your sign. If your closet is looking unorganized, it only needs like five or 10 minutes and then it can be all organized. And yeah, it definitely looks a lot better. I just like to color coordinate things. It's just easy for me to find and easy for me to see like how many colors I have of like a certain color or how many, yeah, how many, how many numbers, how many, how many shirts or whatever you get, you guys get what I'm trying to say. Like how many shirts I have of like a certain color. So I did that. And I just like to organize it in terms of like lightest all the way to long sleeve. So that's what I did. So I have all my white here. Then you go into like nudes and beige color, gray, brown and black. So that's kind of how I like to organize things. Obviously everyone's different, but it's definitely looking a lot better. Hello everyone, so happy Wednesday. I just finished the work day and I just got in a package from Aritzia. We're not surprised whatsoever. <laughs> Been here less than a week and this is my second Aritzia package. Uh, whoops. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna open this up for you guys. I really hope I like this. And yeah, apologies for my greasy hair. I've had my hair in a hat all day and we're gonna go outside in a second so I'm probably just gonna put that back on but I just took it off because we're inside. But, cool. So this is what I got. It's a cute little matching set. So I really hope I like this. I originally had ordered um, the set in a different color and I think I still prefer that colorway slightly more. I'll put a photo here of the actual one that I ordered and I got the shorts in a size small and I just felt like they needed to be a little bit baggier. So I got the medium instead. And this is the... This is the print here. So it's just like a pretty blue kind of color and it's striped. I like the stripe. I think I, I think it just adds something different to the set, makes it slightly more unique than just a standard color. It kind of looks like PJs, so I'll have to try it on and see uh, what I think of it. And then the shirt was the issue that I had the last time. So when I'd ordered the set, I'd ordered like this shirt in a large and they ended up like I ended up buying it, but then they didn't have enough in stock to give me one. So I got an email saying they couldn't fulfill my order, which I was so upset about. Um, so I ordered the matching shirt for this color. So it's hard to see, but again, it's just that same pattern. And I'm not sure how it's gonna fit me because I don't normally order things that are large, but I just wanted it to be oversized with a pair of shorts. I thought this would be a cute set for the summertime to have under like a bikini or just like a white little um, sports bra or something like that. So I wanna try it on. So this is what the set looks like on. I think it's pretty cute. Definitely these are pretty baggy on me now cause I got the medium. The small fit well around my waist but I felt like it was too tight um, on my butt. So I got the medium which I think is just more relaxed. So I actually think this worked out pretty well cause it's not like tight fitting or anything. And then I got this again in the large, maybe I could have done a medium, but the whole point was I wanted it to be very like baggy and oversized, but, but it definitely needs to be steamed or ironed or something. Cause yeah, but I think I'll try it on another day when I have like the right top on with it, but I think it'll be cute in the summer or if I'm going to like a coffee shop or something, just like an easy lightweight summer kind of look. So we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> we just arrived at Dorothea Dix Park. This is going to be, I guess, our first like thing we're doing exploring in Raleigh. So we'll take you guys along. We're gonna walk around. It looks pretty nice. I don't really know like what we're gonna do. I think we saw a sign saying like there's a flower field up there. So we're gonna take Honey for a walk, just get some beautiful fresh air. It is like a really nice warm day today. It's in the 80s, which is so nice. We're gonna go explore and yeah, I'll show you guys what it looks like. Just 
So for dinner tonight, we're having the salmon bowl made from TikTok. You guys know I eat this all the time, but this looks really, really good. There's a ton of salmon on here. So it's gonna be a very filling dinner. Hello everyone, happy Thursday. Again, I have finished the work day. I had every intention of starting this vlog earlier today, but it was kind of a busy day for me. Um, I'm dressed quite professionally in my blazer today because I actually had a client facing meeting, which was really nice. So I didn't really have like too much to say in the meeting myself, but it was really nice to just be included and hear about some of the stuff that we're doing with our clients. So that was really fun. That's why I'm dressed a lot more professionally today, although I'm still wearing like biker shorts. So it's like professional on the top but casual on the bottom so love that work from home life but yeah we went to Dick's Park yesterday it was really nice they're definitely still under like they're definitely still cleaning up from the festival they had over the weekend so we could, didn't have access to the entire park but I know there's this huge expansion program going on so I think next year it's going to be even more improved with like restaurants and just like fun stuff like that so that was fun but it was just nice to be outside and just sit and just get some sun and really just walk around and explore the area. So that was good. And then yeah, today, like I mentioned, I just kind of worked all day. Didn't really turn on the camera at all. It was just a, you know, a couple meetings today, client facing meetings, and then just getting stuff done because it's almost the end of the week. So that was kind of my work day. And right now it is absolutely downpouring with rain. It's like crazy. We're on a tornado watch right now. And if you guys know me in real life, I'm a big storm girl. I'm obsessed with like, if you go to hotels and you watch the weather channel and they talk about, I don't know, tornadoes or storms in like Oklahoma or places like that for me like I just love storms I'm just a little crazy I love hearing that kind of stuff so we're on that right now so of course I'm loving that <laughs> but yeah it's actually like really crazy outside but we're about to go change um, we're gonna go and just do a little bit of a sauna today we're not gonna work out or anything it's just kind of one of those lazy days and yeah I just want to have a nice shower and feel fresh after that it's definitely hair washing day today my hair is so dirty but let me show you what this weather outside is doing it is crazy it's really hard for you to see but the wind is like really really coming down and the rain is too it's like really crazy so this is what I'm wearing for the sauna just an old sports bra since I'm just gonna get really sweaty and some tight fitting biker shorts um, and then just a pair of sandals so I can take those off. Got my water so I can stay hydrated because I know you get really hydrated and that and my hair is up and I will wash it when I get back which will feel so good. So. later now we actually ended up I was in my PJs all comfy cozy ready to spend the night in and then Jay was like wait we need to run a couple errands so we just went to Best Buy we needed a new like charging brick because Justin's charging brick wasn't working and then we went to Home Goods, bought a bunch of socks because um, Honey just like steals all of our socks and our other ones were just kind of like old and gross from our old apartment our old apartment's floors were stained um, with some sort of like wood stain and it just like would transfer onto your socks so badly so we went and bought like 20 pairs of socks so now we're set for socks and yeah I've just been sitting here I just wrapped up editing um tomorrow's video and it uploaded I actually cannot believe how fast it uploaded I was shocked like it was a it was like a 16 17 minute video and it uploaded in under a minute like I'm not even joking you normally on my old wi-fi it would take 30 minutes at least maybe like 40 minutes kind of thing so the video going live tomorrow is the moving vlog so I'm so excited for you guys to see that I think that's the video before this one so make sure you've watched that if you haven't already it's kind of us over the weekend moving everything in and then I also just sent over my picks for all right so I thought I would show that with you guys um so these are the two things that I ended up getting I'm going to be working with them over on Instagram so I do have a code um that you guys can use if you want I'll have it on the screen here but yeah I really do love working with all right so if you guys do choose to support me thank you you so much if you do um it does help me in a small bit i don't really don't think i get a lot from it but if you just choose to use my discount code i really appreciate you guys 
but they honestly have the best jewelry. I literally only wear pretty much all right, all right jewelry and I love that they're female, female owned. They're also like very sustainable. They re use recycled gold and all of that stuff. This isn't obviously sponsored. I'm just letting you guys know that I'm literally obsessed with their pieces. Most of my jewelry is all right and it's just so high quality. Um, I'm obsessed. So I'm excited to be working with them over on Instagram. Um, so yeah, I got two new pieces. I got these cute little like gold huggy earrings, which I'm obsessed with. And then I got another ring as well. There's so many things I want on the website. So I'm so excited for again, the next month. I'm working with them for three months in total. So um, I'm just really excited for that. I have so much Ori jewelry and I just need more. <laughs> I'm obsessed, but yeah. So that's kind of what we've been doing. Jay just ran out to go grab us some pizza. We're feeling extra lazy tonight, even though we literally are having pizza tonight and tomorrow we're going to go out for food again. So I don't know what it is. We're just not in the mood to cook. We're not in the mood to dirty the kitchen and we're just going to have another chill night in. But I think tomorrow will be more of an exciting day so it can bring you a little bit more on some more exciting things. So that's kind of the update. So yeah. It looks so good. Mm, that smells so fresh. Good morning everyone, happy Friday. Literally just sitting here about to start my work day. I had my coffee and now I'm just ice rolling my face. If you guys don't have one of these, I have it linked on my Amazon shop below. This one's really cute, the pink color, but this is like literally the best thing ever. I it's supposed to help with like inflammation and that kind of thing, but it honestly just feels so good. I don't care if it even doesn't do anything to my face. It just feels so good on your face. It's like the best part of my morning routine other than coffee, to be honest. <laughs> it feels so good, especially on a hot day or if you're done, for, like if you finished a workout and you shower and you're still kind of hot, this feels so good. So yeah, good morning. Um, today I don't have a crazy busy day. I really just have one meeting in the morning, one meeting in the evening, and what well, evening? I mean like at the end of my work day. Um, so it's kind of a later meeting. And then afterwards we're going to be doing a little bit of a date night, which I'm really excited about. We're going to be checking out the Glenwood South area. Um, and going to a place called the Raleigh Beer Garden. Apparently they have a lot of beer selection. And yeah, we take turns planning date nights. So this was my date night. Um, I just wanted to do something kind of casual and I felt like Justin would really like it because it's kind of like bar food and a ton of beers. I want to say they have like 350 beers. I think someone told me that. Um, but point being, they have a lot of beer selection. I'm not a beer drinker, but I'm sure they'll have like a cider or wine or something for me, so figured that would be something fun to do. So that's gonna be our date night tonight and I'm really excited for that. And yeah, so I guess I'm probably gonna start the work day now. I'm excited, my moving vlog comes out today, so I'm excited to see what you guys think of our moving day. We had such an early start, which was like crazy, but I'm excited for you guys to see that. And yeah, I think that's everything. I think I'm just gonna start the work day and I will catch up with you guys a little bit later, I think once we're getting ready for date night. And if you guys are local to the Raleigh area, please let me know of any good restaurants or any kind of recommendations that you have, um, because I would love to know and we definitely wanna try out a lot of like good food places here. So let me know. <laughs> got to the Raleigh Beer Garden. I'm so excited. This was like a surprise J um, date night for Jay and I. I've said that before that we kind of like to like plan a date night and then like not tell the other person until kind of we get there thing. It's a little bit more fun but I just did my makeup. It looks really good. I don't know if you can tell in the lighting but I used all Merit Beauty products. I love their cream products and how natural it looks. It's just I'm obsessed with it but I just wanted to quickly show you guys. This isn't sponsored or anything. Their latest lipsticks. So these are these signature lipsticks. They're brand new and I picked up this stunning nude pink color. It's in the color baby so I wanted to just show you guys what it looks like on. So 
I think this will go really well and kind of just like top off my date night look. I need a better mirror than the viewfinder though. Yeah, this is a, such a pretty color. It's kind of like natural lips, but better. Yeah, that's super pretty. I also got another color. I'll see if I can like insert um, like a photo of it. It's called Cabo and that looks like such a fun color for when you're on like a tropical vacation or you are, I don't know, like... I don't know, a proper, a different date night than a beer garden, but it looks like a beautiful red color. So this is the lip color on. I think this is so stunning. It's perfect for like a very neutral and kind of casual date night. So I'll get a couple of clips of this place. This place looks super pretty. And so yeah, let's head out. Let's go. <laughs>